All right, so Mother, you said it yourself. You said business is going to be choppy during the pandemic. So explain to people why it is choppy and a little harder to forecast. Well, because, you, you know, the, the way the transmission of the disease is taking place, it's bouncing all around. We said not too long ago that we thought it was going to have a, uh, a, a strong, it was strong in, in April, May. We thought it was going to be some small peaks in the summer, then maybe another wave potentially um, in November. That didn't happen. Now we have a very strong peak right now. It's probably a continuation of the first one. People have forgotten their masks for a long time. There was social, no social distancing, and it's come back. We can't control how people react to it. We can coach them and tell them, and it's, it's very strong. When it's strong, it impacts earnings. Well, Michael, you used the, the term that we could see, be seeing this well into next year. That's somewhat opposite of the president's timetable of October or Moderna's of October. It, to me, it seems more realistic because you have to give people shots and have them walk around for a couple of months at least before you know what the, the, the results might be. We're not going to know how long the vaccine lasts. Everything I'm reading and hearing, how long the antibodies stay in the system, we don't know that. So, I mean, there's, there's a lot to be proven. There's an exuberance on the vaccine, which I understand. I can have a little bit myself, but there's a lot to be proven. So I'm, I'm being cautious. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.